So I did my new student dialogue on age. I don't know what it was. Um, it was age but a number, something like that. And it was basically just about like what is age. And I feel like that age is mostly a label that we use for the, that for the most part isn't correct anyways. It's just some stereotype we use. There's no solid justification behind it. We can't say why we have it. We just kind of have it. It's stupid. Um, in every country, there are different requirements for the same thing. It's like in Europe, the legal drinking age is 18, while here in the United States, it's 21. And they seem to handle it just fine. So what's to say that we can't handle it? I mean, the most popular reason behind like why we can't drink until we're 21 is that we're not mature enough to handle it. So why are they more mature than we are? Like, what makes the difference? What makes maturity level either? Because we don't get married until we're like 25 or 30 now, and that's like the normal. But back in like the olden days, like in the 1900s, like 1800s, they were getting married to like 18 and like having kids at 20. And here now, it's like whoa, like slow down a second, hold on. But age is just used to describe how old we are, and inversely, how mature we are, which. But like, what about all those quotes that depress, like talk about people who were, who were young with an old brain, or vice versa, like young, old with a young brain? I feel like the quote by Yanko Ano, some people are old at 18 and some are young at 90. Time is a concept that humans created, just captures this ideal perfectly. Like, age is just a measurement of time, and time isn't set in stone. So who are we? To, we just see it as we choose to. Like, see age as you want to, see time as you want to, whatever. It's no big deal. Um, so in our new student dialogue, we explored the different age requirements countries had for different things, such as like voting, drinking age, driving age, and I was like shocked at some of them. The most one, the one that I was most shocked at was the age requirements in Likistan, that you can't vote until you're 30. Like your life is almost done, especially there. Like they don't have the same medical technology we do, so like they're really almost like dead. Um, here in the United States, I feel like we can't vote. We like we start voting really young. Like most eighteen-year-olds haven't been that exposed to politics, aren't so well informed. Not being able to vote until you're thirty excludes like. Okay, so we need to like be more informed. But eighteen's like it's young, but like it's doable. But not being able to vote until you're like eight, eighteen or until you're thirty, you're excluding a whole section of the population that has like different views and the people that already have their jobs and live their life and know where they're growing. Um, we also discussed like what is being an adult, and we decided that age is a number that describes whether you're adult enough here in the United States. But and then so we define like what being adult means, and we decided it means you're independent, you pay your own bills, and you know how to make good decisions for what you want. But then again, these criteria are like very loose. You can change them because some people pay pays bills when they're young, like they pay their cell phone bill, then they pay car payments, then they. Oh, they make credit card payments. I mean, they make a lot of stuff. And like, so what do we classify as paying your own bills? Is it like until you pay a house payment mm. sooner? And I don't know. I mean, it is. but it's hard for people who are in between, like in different countries and like different places, even where people are in, in between being considered an adult and a and not an adult when they move from like a place that considers them adult to a place that doesn't consider them adult. It's really hard for them. The same goes dip the, the other way around, like being being not an adult to being an adult. There's so much freedom. Um, when you move from a place that you're not considered an adult, you encounter like major differences, make you feel oppressed, like you're stuck in a cage. I don't know, we experienced this with our exchange student in Sweden, like she came over here and she wasn't an adult over here and she couldn't travel to the same place and like she had to check in with my mom and she just hated it, like ruined her experience and I mean, I can see that like she went and she was totally free and like she did her own things, they trusted her, they felt like, so she came over here and she felt like she wasn't trusted and that's like, that's a burn. Um, then, so but they also run into problems the different way when you go from not being considered an adult to being considered an adult. Like, you're overwhelmed with all the freedom you have, you can go crazy, going crazy too much, make you too much trouble. So that's problematic there. And then like most so but most of us have experienced this, so it's not and it's it is a problem. Like when we go to college, we're going somewhere where we're free, we can do whatever. And I don't know, I mean I just it's weird. It's, 
so it depends on how much to an extent it is, is how much you were had like set rules at home and couldn't do anything. But that was basically my new student dialogue. We determined what we decided what determines age or discuss this. We, you can't actually really decide it. It's like never going to be decided. But in our discussion, we determined age was just a number somewhat related to maturity and maybe maturity level would be a better description of like when you can do something deciding better deciding factor when you can do something such as drink and vote and drive but we run into major problems to finding the level of maturity and making that accurate and fair so we stick to age because age is something you can it's kind of set in stone and like you know what age you are no questions asked when you're born that's how old you are but I don't know it's just it's a problem that we're never really gonna finish and age is just varies it's just a number it doesn't really mean that much because it's not actually set and it varies so much from country to country but that was my new student dialogue um, it was a new student dialogue we went and talked about that we just discussed a lot of different things and saw different people's viewpoints so